first picture of taxi driver who crashed into World Cup fans in Moscow after 20-hour shift. The taxi driver who plowed his vehicle into a crowd of World Cup fans in Moscow on Saturday said he had been working non-stop for 20 hours. China's Anur Bekulu, 28, said he passed out moments before his taxi mounted the pavement and struck the football supporters. Eight people, reportedly including two Mexicans, two Russians, a Ukrainian and two Azerbaijani citizens, were hurt. One remains in a critical condition in hospital. When asked how long he had been behind the wheel, Ulu replied, to be honest, about 20 hours. To view this video please enable JavaScript, and consider upgrading to a web browser that supports HTML5 video The married dad, who has a Kyrgyzstan driving license, told police officers, I wanted to stop, I wanted to let one man pass. I wanted to stop, it was just one second and I pressed the accelerator instead. And I thought I was pushing the brakes, I don't know, and I passed out. And then I saw people being pushed. And then I ran away. I was afraid, they would have killed me, so many people there. Officers interrogated Ulu this morning after he was arrested. Police would not comment further on the investigation. The use of vehicles as weapons has been among security concerns at the World Cup. Moscow's streets have been lined with around enthusiastic supporters from all over the world. The tournament began on Thursday when Russia humiliated Saudi Arabia 5-0. More, taxi driver chased down Moscow street after crashing into World Cup fans more, taxi plows into crowd of World Cup fans in Moscow leaving eight injured.